What's up everyone? I am Bug here. And today I'm really excited. My favorite genre, the horror genre, is combined with a Christmas season. Making a Christmas horror story. Perfect for this time of year. If you like what you see here today, please remember to hit that subscribe and like button to see more gaming content. Now the game I'm going to play today is called Crimson Snow, and it's available on Steam. I'll have links for the game down below. Hi, handsome. What have you now, when it comes to horror, I don't like to know a lot about the story or the plot. I find it twice as scary if you let it unfold as you get immersed into it. So with that, I can tell you this. Crimson Snow is a horror game that takes place on Christmas night. What should have been a peaceful Christmas night for our girlfriend and us, exchanging gifts, turns into a very sinister night, as an evil present lurks throughout the house. Now, we are trapped in a spooky yet Christmassy looking house that we have to escape and survive from. So let's dive into this game and see what horrors Santa has brought us. All right, here we are inside Crimson Snow, and it is snowing like crazy outside. Right, our cell phone's ringing. Look, it's on top of a Christmas story. Hi, handsome. What have you been up to while your better half wasn't around? Well, you know, making videos. I'm warning you, Mark, if you watch the third season of Dark Vengeance without me, there will be blood. We've already finished negotiations, so I'll be home sooner than you think. I took a bunch of pics, just like you asked. Let me send you one right now. What do you want to see? My photo in the mountains, or from the pool? I forgot to say, that hotel had a luxurious swimming pool. Alright, what photo do you want to see? Let's see the mountains photo. I bet you that one's going to make her interested. The weather was amazing. There was almost no wind. It was a perfect time for snowboarding. It's too bad that negotiations took so long. Ah, <laughs> uh, isn't she just a darling? Gone with me. I know that you don't like meeting new people, but I'm worried about you, Mark. I'm pretty much the only person you talk to. It's Christmas Eve, and no one's even congratulated you yet. Did someone write you a personal letter? I believe That's so. so cool. Open it up and tell me what's inside. It's near the entrance, right? I like that there's Christmas music playing in the background. All right, so. I wonder what's inside the envelope. Look, we got a nice Christmas tree set up. All right, there's her door, so there's the envelope. Keep your mail at the front door. I'm not going to read it out loud, but I'll leave it so you can read it. Well, who's it from? What did they write? I don't think we should tell her that. Um, tax office. That's a bad lie. That's so nice. I thought you stopped communicating with them. It's so good that I was wrong. By the way, about oh, this looks nice. This does not feel like a horror game right now. Christmas music, fire crackling. Alright, up to my bedroom window, eh? You won't see anything. Look, I got beanbag chairs. Go upstairs and look through your bedroom window. Um, so I'm flickering their light. Your girlfriend doesn't mess around with lights. She subtly hints to her obtuse boyfriend that she returned from the Alps. Now, on to the second part of my surprise. But first, show me your festive mood. Um, how am I gonna do that? Let me think. I remember you had some sparklers in your closet. Light them up in front of your window. 
Alright, sparklers in the closet. Got two doors, that one looks like a closet door. I'm sorry I didn't come to your home right away, but I had to prepare oh. something. We have, have the laundry room, room off our personal bedroom. That must be noisy. Sparklers. Oh, is that a sparkler? Handheld flare. Uh, that'll do. If you find the sparklers, light one of them up by the bedroom window so I can see it. It's a flare. It's not a sparkler. I don't think it's safe to set off a flare in your house. There it is! Now I can feel the Christmas spirit! Alright, here's the second part of the surprise. Do you remember that French wine you wanted to buy? Until you saw the price tag? Today? We'll try it out! I also got some fireworks. So, take your sparklers and come over. Let's celebrate Christmas together! Take my flares? Right. Yes. Did you We're get me gonna too? die from a house fire. Gift you prepared? Okay, now I'm interested. Grab it and come over. I'm waiting. The longer you wait, the greater the chance that I'll drink all of your wine by myself. Take your gift and come to see me. It's under the tree, isn't it? You seem to know a lot about where things are in my house. Alright, how do I get rid of this road flare? I don't feel comfortable walking through the house with the road flare. What's this room? Are you sure that you have a present? Mark, I won't be upset if you didn't buy one. It's just... Well, I thought it was going to be a Laptop. special night. Look under the tree, okay? Oh... Is that what I think it is? Yep. That's an engagement ring. If you found the gift, come see me already. It's the same book that was upstairs. Alright, let's put on a coat. This is it? I have no coats? These drawers? Oh, I love games that let you snoop. Alright, into the freezing cold we go. Did you leave the house? It's easy to get lost in this weather. Follow the light, handsome. I'm waiting for you. Oh wow, that snow's getting thick. Alright, there's the light. Christmas music. <laughs> Somebody laugh. Here we go. Look at that. That is a nice Christmas setting. Did you sink into the snow? Hurry up, I'm getting tired of waiting. In your what house? What does inside your house mean? I'm standing at the door and I didn't see you come in. Hey Santa, it looks like you broke into the wrong house. Get out of there before you get- Uh oh. Alright, so how do we go to the wrong house? Do we not know where our girlfriend lives? Like, she's her girlfriend. This isn't looking very Christmassy anymore.
I could snoop in games like this all day. Looks like we're going back the way we came. Let's get out of this place. the hell is that? Uh, hello. Um, I'm trying to leave your house. Window? Window? Why can we never just jump out a window? Uh, I don't seem to have a run button. How am I supposed to go? I'm not going by that freaky chick. Oh man, they're gonna make me go by the freaky chick. So no. Look, I went into the wrong house. I'm a little stupid. Making tiptoe. Let's get the hell out of here. Locked. Again, why can't we break these damn windows? All the milk and cookies are gone. Need a flashlight or something. I have a cell phone. Why don't I turn on the light on that? To use spooky TV for turning on? Creating like a really nice atmosphere. Wow, this place has gone to shit. The hell? That room. Oh, meatballs. Okay, I think these are the people that live here. This looks horrible. That looks nice, and then over here looks like something from Resident Evil. Weird place for a chair. Well, there is definitely some drywall damage here. Is your sleigh bells? Do your sleigh bells? Call day. He's coming soon, so I need to get ready. Dress, Christmas tree, decorations, fireworks. Why has everyone got fireworks for Christmas? I, I don't have fireworks for Christmas, or know anyone does fireworks for Christmas. Is that like a tradition somewhere else? Oh, what the fuck? Oh shit. Honey, um, are yeah. you there? Run, 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 run. Why is the doors always fucking locked? Um. Oh shit. I got no gun. I got nothing. Oh no. Ah. Uh, yeah, she's not pretty. Oh. Try this again. Running out of options here. She finds us behind the door. She comes in, she looks there. I think I'm gonna hide. Here. 
Honey, are you there? Damn it, I wish I could crouch. Get the hell out of here. Um, all right, I'm squeezing through here. We are far away from the scary lady. Oh, shit. All right, you know, houses don't do that sort of stuff. Um, yeah. Not a good time for a call. Mark, stop scaring me. I know that you're here. I found the Christmas tree that you knocked over. And why did you take off its decorations? Do you even know how long it took me to decorate it? Eddie, you're crazy. What do you mean it wasn't you? Then who was walking around my house? Mark, seriously, don't scare me like that. What's going on? Mark, do you need help? I can... Wait. There's someone here. Alright, so these are Choice Matters questions with our girlfriend. Alright, it's Christmassy again. Uh-oh. Okay. Chained up room. I don't remember which way was not the scary lady way. So there's only this way. Here, a music box. And I have a flare. that music coming from? Here we go. Snuggler. Oh, this is totally Resident Evil. We gotta put a snow globe into a notch of a door. Just walking around. Oh shit. Close. No, can't close the door. Sweet. Hide behind the door. Where are you? Not in here. Wait, go away, go away, go away. Hmm? Ah! <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna see these guys outside of the game. Wow. That game was just amazing. I didn't know if I should have been in the Christmas festival mood with the Christmas songs and the lights playing, or if I should be terrified out of my mind from the sound effects and the creepy atmosphere and that spooky looking girl just sent chills down my spine. This was definitely a great horror adventure. If you're in the horror games, this is a must play.
don't let the Christmas vibe throw you off. This is still one spooky title. It's Crimson Snow on Steam, and the links will be down below for it. If you're a horror fan, you have to check this out. It's going to bring a whole new meaning to Christmas. A horror experience of Christmas. And it must be played. Well, thanks for joining me, guys. And until the next adventure, cheers.